Hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. And last time we started and completed level 4. Uh, one other thing I've been noticing is that like, if I click off my Zelda Classic screen here to check my recording time, you might notice the sound gets a little bit quieter. Maybe it's not doing it on your end. Maybe it's just uh, on my end. Yeah, the sound will get quieter until I go into, like, a dungeon or hidden, like, the stairs down there. Yeah, I really don't want to be going through the desert. Why am I going through the desert? This is an awful idea. Some of the restrictive way that the this re-envisioned Hyrule is it's kind of a hassle to try and get around to certain Um, you weren't there before. Okay, shooting you with an arrow is not the solution. You know, I have boulders coming. And you know, we still don't have the power bracelet. Maybe we'll get that in level 5. Okay, so here we are. And is there another way out of... I don't think there is, because if you go right... I think left is the only way out of here, yeah. So what we have to do, we just have to keep going up. It's up, 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 up. If you put in a wrong input, you just kind of get back to the start of... Where are you at with this? Okay. Level 5. The Lizard. One thing, I don't think we can... Maybe I should have picked up more bombs before coming in here. Uh, I'm still going to try and avoid... Ah, I heal. So we're going to try and avoid the spikes as much as possible, just because of how quickly that drains our magic. I'm going to use the uh, bombable spots first, because when you bomb open a door, you can't get into a situation where the door shuts on you, and you're locked in, in that room until, you know, whenever. We have mummies, aka okay, Gibdos. Yeah, we're going to get the power bracelet here, because I can't push this. Oh, I love the music in this game. I'm not sure exactly where this rendition of this uh, classic Zelda tune is from. But I'm digging it. Yeah, sometimes if you walk through a door, it might lock you in. That's not the case here. I could probably pick up a couple other pieces of heart. That's a basic key, I believe. Uh, now that we have the step ladder. But I'm going to wait until we get through this. Classic Dongo tactic. Oh, that's not better to Dongo. Ouch. Ouch. Oh, 
I walked into the smoke too fast. There we go. I get money for that. Money doesn't really mean a ton to me right now anymore. This does not look like a spot I want to be. Oh, hello. Didn't fully realize what was going on here. Oh, there's another key. Get that out of here. Now I can just concentrate dealing with shenanigans. And here we have to go in here. And run like mad. See, it is possible to navigate that room without taking a ton of damage. Two for one special, and lots of bombs. Uh, let's take a key door. This will get us something. Just don't face... The dark nuts directly, and you can hit them much easier to do with slash. Oh, we need the step ladder there. <gasps> the hook shot. Yeah, after this, we're gonna go exploring the world again, and we'll pick up things that we can with the hook shot. Don't be blasting me. Oh, me too. I gotta get better at dodging those. <laughs> okay, where else haven't we gone? I mean, we do have a key to go straight up. Uh, before we do that, we're gonna go to the right here. And before we do that, we're gonna die off. Oh, this room will kill us. There's a thing in this room. I want to see... The hookshot, we are also invincible while we use it. We can maybe use that to our advantage. I can't, obviously. can also just cross through there. Anyways, uh, the hookshot can stun some enemies that the magical boomerang cannot. The hookshot can also be somewhat riskier to use, because once you start using it, you're kind of locked into place. Oh, I got the map. Okay, I got the map, and I got the hook shot. But there's no way for me to progress. Unless I can... Unless I can't push that. Um, hmm. So I missed a power bracelet, or I need to get the power bracelet from somewhere in the overworld. Because we've kind of been everywhere else in this dungeon that we can go right now. dead. There we go. That's at least slightly better. Because down here was just where we got a key. Yeah. 
we're gonna have to go we're gonna have to explore the overworld a little bit we have a hook shot to do that now oh hi there So hopefully we can find the things that we need. This is just where we got... Actually, this spot might be good for getting a couple hearts. Or a good amount of hearts. Hey. Knock that off. Hey, does anybody remember where all the hookshot spots are? That's some epic and lucky dodging there. That is not a hookshot spot. How do we get up there? Uh, let's try firing this. Oh, that didn't do anything. Um, oh, hey, we can step ladder our way over here. And this gets us somewhere new. There isn't going to be a spot to bomb on here because we have a spot to walk into. I want that heart. Okay, what do you have? If you like burning stuff, then step up to Claire's Burn Burn Fun House. <laughs> wow, yeah, I like the sound of that. The object is to burn the shrub flowers that open within the time limit to close them again. It's advised you come back with a lantern that can let you afford a few mistakes. We need the red candle. Oh, 500 is our maximum here. Oh, hey. I just don't have anything to really spend my money on at the moment. Because it's all the same silly stuff. I'm going to buy that. Just refresh our magic. Uh, not going to go down right away. Just going to continue along this path. I can spend my money on arrows. Oh, this is likely one of those door repair charge rooms. Alright, where is this snow peak? These, I believe, are the level 2 Lionels. Do I even want to be here right now? I don't think the power bracelet's over here. It's a secret to everybody! Well, let's be real, if I don't pick that up, I'm going to forget about it anyways. Enemy bait, heart, and a cheaper shield. If I'm ever in this neighborhood and need a shield replacement. Yeah, and arrows can also pick up items from a distance. A potion shop. That is a full magic restore there.
That's a secret. Get out of my way. Don't keep me from my secrets. Uh, Snow Peak being a reference. Fine. I was kind of hoping for the loss there. I don't think, at least in this quest, that Snow Peak... Yeah. Uh, anyways, reference to Twilight Princess. Which I don't mind references to Twilight Princess at all. Uh, but that doesn't actually get us anything. I don't know. Either... Oh, there's our power bracelet. I found it. Completely by accident, but I found it. Uh, oh, we can just walk into this tree. Buy a couple more super bombs. That wouldn't be a horrible way to use my money. Speaking of super bombs, there's got to be something good there if it's going to require a super bomb. Royal Graveyard. We're over by level 6. But that's cool. We're just exploring. I have arrows. Make a profit by launching that arrow. Oh, sure, why not? Okay, fine, I'll take a little bit of damage. Ah, uh, that door's locked. Why is that door locked? Gotta find a thing to push? Go forward again. I found a thing to push. Oh, forget it. I've done this already. I think there's got to be something good in here if it's requiring all of this effort. But what is it going to be? There we go. Okay, now we got to figure this out. So this one can go on to that. And we can kind of do that anytime we want. And then that bottom one there is going to have to go up to that one. Which doesn't seem like it should be that difficult to pull off. Because all I would have to do... I just say all I should have to do was, yeah. Uh, this one can just get right out of our way now. This can just get right out of our way. Oh, there we go. Uh, 
Oh, that's uh, one of the things that permanently extends our magic meter. Awesome. Well, that was definitely worth it. Now you get out of this mess again. Okay. Now that we're nice and hurt. I'm gonna head back down into the graveyard. What else can we find around here? Besides level six. That's totally level six. I'm like 90% sure this is level six. This is level six. <laughs> the dragon. Oh, that music is awesome in it. But uh, we haven't finished level five. I mean, with the power bracelet, we now can do that, but we're kind of now taking a moment to explore since we have the hook shot. Why is there... Statue of Link. I'm pretty sure we can do something with this. I would hate to waste my last super bomb and not get anything! Oh well. Uh, we do have to buy more of those. Uh, the graveyard somewhere in here. We can find the... Oh, that actually worked. The level 3 sword. Uh, but we are not strong enough to pick it up. We need a few more hearts. There's a... I think I'm supposed to... Get it on each of those spots. Not what I meant to do. Ah, oh, there's a piece of heart. All right, and with that, I think we're kind of heading into overtime here, but once you start exploring a new area, you just kind of don't want to stop, you know? Oh, whoops. Okay, that's not anything. Oh, which Zelda is this music from? Ooh, nice, more regular bombs. I want to say Majora's Mask. Okay, we come down here, we're out of the graveyard. And back into the Lost Woods. Yeah, why not? We'll play around here uh, next time. We'll explore our way all over the place and maybe end up back at level 5. <laughs>